Here in Solibri Model Checker, we are going to do some analysis of the Arboleda project. So first, we are going to open the different IFCs of the Arboleda project. Here in this window, I can define um, the different disciplines of each of the IFCs that, I, that we are importing here. For example, this one is electrical, these other IFCs for ventilation, and this final one is for the discipline of plumbing. And here we have the model, the whole model of Arboleda with all the disciplines together. Architectural, electrical, plumbing and ventilation. Here I can hide some components and uh, visually uh, analyze the model and get some attributes of elements. For example, for this column, I can get its location, quantities quantification of the area, etc., uh, materials, etc. So I can get all the information for each element here. For example, for this wall, also I can get the quantification, gross area, area of doors, windows, etc. So let's hide here this wall in order to be able to see through and see inside of this room here. So I can pretty much selectively uh, hide or show each part of the model. If I want here in this list, I can get the components list. For example, I can just see the spaces that um, are defined inside Arboleda. Uh, for example, let's uh, activate here electrical ventilation and plumbing, and I want just to see this part of this model. So I can see uh, these three disciplines together. And uh, let's, for example, add in this selection basket, add the stairs, the walls here, and um, the flow terminals, like sanitaries, etc. And um, I'm going to add also these labs into this selection basket. So I click this Add. And uh, let's remove the walls from the selection basket. So I can see... Um, those components, just those components here in the model, and make some kind of um, analysis, visual analysis, if I want, into different stories. So let's use now some sectioning visualization. Uh, here I have the option section box around selection basket, so I can get uh, um, and see here part of the model, uh, do the sectioning of different um, stories and I can be able to selectively see part of the model and I can for example activate the ventilation and add the ventilation visualization to this uh, section here so I can visualize part of the ducts into this model and also add for example the plumbing discipline here and uh, this makes easier to visualize some details in the Arboleda model. Okay, so let's move into the checking layout. Uh, and uh, I'm going to select here some rule sets I want to check in the Arboleda model. Some basic ones for beam validation, general space checking, and architectural elements. Um, here I have some painting classifications that I need to classify here in the model. Uh, there are some unclassified components that I can classify if I want here. Uh, it's recommended. But let's uh, ignore those and, and I'm gonna check all these three rule sets. I'm gonna check those. So I click here, check anyway, and I'm going, going ahead and I'm going to run this check of those rule sets, those three rule sets, which are checking for the beam validation of the model, space checking, and intersection between architectural components. Here I have the result summary of all the checking we run, and for each of the rule sets that we run. Clicking here, I can deactivate the, the low and, and moderate levels, and focus in only in the critical severity level. And then I will be able to see, for example, uh, the space location. And I have some space intersections here in the model. Let's check for those issues.
And uh, here I have one of the issues is the uh, intersection between those two spaces. In fact, one space is defined inside the other. And um, this is one of the problems we had here in the, this model. Here in these uh, intersections between architectural components rule set, we had some uh, intersections between um, columns and beams, as we can see here. There is this interference, this uh, uh, intersection, and also this another one here of the column and the beam. We had also some uh, intersections between beams and slabs. And in this case, we had uh, some occurrences in, in many stories, as we can see here. And finally, let's check for some intersections in building services. Uh, we had uh, some intersections between ducts and cold water pipes, as we can see here. And also for ducts and the heating return pipes. Um, and some other clashes. Since uh, those these models uh, is from the project in very early stage, we had uh, several clashes, as we can see here, the ducts and the sewer pipe. And, um, and also clashes in from the architectural elements. Um, I can also communicate here for the other people in the, in the project. And for example, add a slide from this clash and add a comment here to mention about this, this problem that, that was detected, this clash in the Arboleda between HVC and pipe. So uh, other people can see here in this model.